The past 18 years have been filled with accomplishments for Dr. Randall J. Webb and Northwestern State University. Dr. Webb has served as Northwestern president since 1996, and in July, he became the university's longest serving president. Under Dr. Webb's leadership, Northwestern State has received well-deserved national and international attention for its academic programs and student accomplishments. Two capital campaigns have set fundraising records at the school. Dr. Webb has led the move toward higher admission standards at the university, which have resulted in students having greater academic potential and aptitude. Northwestern State has had its largest graduating class in school history while Webb was president. Retention has increased at the university. The average ACT score of students has gone up, and high school leaders have enrolled at Northwestern State in record numbers. Dr. Webb has also expanded the university's outreach by spearheading the development at NSU of the largest electronic education and distance learning network of any university in Louisiana. Northwestern State offers courses and 34 accredited degree programs to students across the nation and world through internet and compressed video. Millions of dollars have been obtained during Dr. Webb's presidency for new and renovated facilities, including the Wellness, Recreation and Activity Center, Student Services Center, Residence Halls, and Academic Buildings. The university achieved Tier 1 status in the U.S. News and World Report ranking of regional universities on two occasions. The undergraduate program in elementary education was ranked fourth in the nation by the National Council on Teacher Quality. The master's program in nursing was rated as one of the top 100 by U.S. News. A new Doctor of Nursing Practice program was created along with a post-master's certificate in global security and intelligence and a master's in homeland security. The university has added new undergraduate academic programs under Dr. Webb. It has been an eventful 18 years for Dr. Webb and Northwestern State has benefited from his vision and leadership. I'm blessed to have such fine people in my corner who have been supportive of me all my life. I'm especially blessed to have been reared by kind, loving parents, Joe and Narvis Webb, who framed for me a marvelous paradigm of the world and the people within it. They taught me several principles of living that I hope I will always follow. Number one, love and trust God absolutely. Number two, love others as myself. Number three, to be a forgiving person and to ask forgiveness if I've wronged another. And number four, to cherish and revere Northwestern State University. I'm driven by trying my best to improve the quality of lives for students and everybody I meet. I think if you focus on people, if that's not what higher education's about, then I've been in the wrong business for you know, 50 years. Because to me, higher education is about people. Northwestern is what I call a university of the people. It always has been a college or school of the people. And uh, I'd sure hate to see it get very far from those roots because uh, I think that's how people develop to their fullest potentials. The fact that he brought this school together in doing so, we, were managed, we managed to accredit 100% of our programs that had an accrediting agency. What motivates me, I guess the thing that motivates me above all else is uh, my wife, Brenda, uh, who loves and supports me 
a person who could have done so many things professionally in life and did so, and, uh, but who subjugated her career to uh, be my wife and to uh, become what I consider to be a, a first lady of Northwestern with real class and taste. And I, I just admire her so much for that. If I had a message to leave with anybody, if anybody's interested, I think the best message anyone could carry in their hearts is to go about every day trying to do good. I hope you enjoy retirement. Even though I miss all the golf cart rides, I'm very proud and happy for you. Love you. You're a great grandfather and a great leader. I hope you enjoy your retirement. You earned it. I look forward to spending more time with you. Hey, Bops, now that you're retired, you can come to St. Louis more. And that means more Cardinal games and more Ted Drews. Have a happy retirement. Hey, Pops, guess what? This year I get to witness two great retirements, you and Derek Jeter. He's the Hall of Famer. You're the all-time greatest. Have a happy retirement. Congratulations, Congratulations and we love, love you, Pops. Go, Go Eagles! Eagles!